Uh, you already see who it is. Boy Derek Diablo Del Boy D. Once again, back in my castle where I be at. Yeah, okay, for the castle. But anyway. So, good news. The boxing match between me and Tommy Robinson is going on. Um, you know, I might have ruffled some feathers with my, my new my newest video, but uh, it was effective because then his management started reaching out on the comments and then got to my NG, IG, to my management, US management, now to my UK management, which I already have in place. So now the two management is talking. It's Now it's gonna happen. We're gonna have this boxing match. It doesn't matter what promoter. Now our management, my management and his management will seek the best deal for us and our families. And you know, if, if, if it, God willing, it goes through it as it's meant to, and this will change both of our lives. It'll be the most money either one of us ever had, fuel our own empires, and both of us are, besides all other stuff that we do, we're both influencers. <laughs> we both are fighters and street fighters and been extreme stuff, but end of the day, he's zero, zero in pro combat sports, and so am I. And I have a lot of experience with other stuff, you know what I mean? But uh, that's not relevant here. British people, British men, respect boxing and bare knuckle boxing. Two men get in there, you slug it out. It's like they don't respect you. British don't understand and respect the whole MMA yet and the jiu-jitsu and the kicking and all that. They almost think, I think most people think it's almost like cheating or something, but it's not cheating. It's just I know way more stuff. But anyway, so uh, now we're both professional fighters. going to be our first boxing match. Both of us get a big purse. And uh, so now it's professional. Forget my hooligan character. The hooliganism is long over with. I'm preserving the culture of to hang out with boys, but that got me to the next stage of just being a lad and being around. So I have already got a lot of fights in the street, little fights that I don't try to hurt anybody and I emerge, you know, unscathed. But please, if you see me around, don't kick off of me. Don't ask me to do the character video. Don't ask me to do all that because now I'm a hooligan Foy Mayweather, you know? And the thing about it is, so to Tommy Robinson, uh, Stephen Axley, now let's you know let's get the best deal let's trust our management let's con you know talk together let's do professional press conferences we we got the hype already for what we did you weren't in on it i know that but it, still i did what i had to do as the director and here we are so best of luck to you anybody can win in the ring let's do automatic rematch so now we get two matches out of it uh make our own teams eventually there's a lot we can do with this a diff whole bunch of different new people uh, that are not being presently used in, in the sphere of influencer boxing. So then, good luck to you, brother, Mr. Robinson, uh, Mr. Yaxley. Um, good luck in your training camp. Hopefully, guy willing, both of us will emerge injury-free. Uh, you know, God bless your family. Have a safe training camp. I'll see you in the ring. I'll do all the press conference. If I have to use my character, I will, you know, because people are fans of it, you know, apart from any fighting. So uh, good luck to you, Mr. Yaxley, and uh, God bless to you and your family and to the Muslims that don't like you and to everybody in the world. You know, like Vandalay Silva said, you know, war in the ring, peace in the world. Cheers.